Hello guys, welcome back to the sawmill. So, uh, last little walk around I did, um, showed you my mill. It's the Range Road 6026. Um, it's a real good mill. Done a lot of, done a lot of cutting on it, uh, past couple of days. I'll show you some of it then. Done earlier. There's some, uh, this is all yellow poplar. Um, uh, this is one log. This is one of them uh, 22 inch logs. Well, other than this, these two didn't. But I ended up getting two by fours and some bunch of one by twelves. Uh, that's some pretty, pretty stuff. But uh, yeah, out of that 22 inch log I saw earlier, I got the. Uh, um, let's see, I got one, two, three, four, five, six. Then there's a couple in a pile over there. Seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, I got 12 one by 12s uh, and then three two by fours and a two by six and then there's a couple of uh, uh, slabs down there I'm going to take the edge off of but, uh, but yeah it's uh, got a lot of lumber out of that one uh, one log and that's uh, those are right at nine feet long so but uh, I'll show you these over here that I got that's the same board or same not same same log, but they're all one by twelve. Uh, like I say, right at nine feet long, but uh, real pretty. Uh, Mill does pretty good. But anyway, on today I want a video. I just got a short. Uh, uh, it's about about six foot long. It's just a red oak. Uh, it's kind of got a lot of rod on it. You can see it there. I done got it up on the mill and mounted, ready to go. Uh, I believe there'll be some, some good material inside there, though. It's not uh, not rotted through the center. It's just where it had laid laid around and got uh, got a lot of punkiness. But uh, there's a lot of good wood inside that log. I'm just going to cut it out and get one by whatever's. <laughs> but that... Uh, but this log, it's, uh, it's four, about 14 inches uh, from top to bottom. It's 16 across on the small end. And here on the big end, it's uh, it's 17 across here and about 15 here. So <clears throat> we're going to take the caps off of it. And like I say, I'm just going to make one buys out of it. Uh, maybe get a couple, maybe get a couple one by tens. If not, one by eights, one by sixes, whatever. It's it's just short, but it'd be good shelving boards. So let me uh, <clears throat> get you guys set up over here, and we'll get start cutting this thing.
All right, guys. There we go. So we end up getting a, a one, two, three, four, five, and that top one, six, and then seven, eight, nine, ten. We end up getting ten one by tens out of those. Those are ten inches wide. So we end up getting 10 one by tens and a couple of uh, couple of slabs here. Uh, this one here I made make that a one, probably cut that down, make that a one by eight. And this one here, I'll edge it off and it'll be a one by ten. Hang on, get a one by eight out of that one. So not too bad for a, a log that looked like it seen the better days. That's some really pretty, uh, pretty red oak. That's good facing. Not a lot of, not a whole lot of knots in it. Got, got one here. Got some curly going on there. Look at that. I just noticed that. Let's see if we can, uh, see if we can shine that one up a little with some water. See what it looks like. Sorry about the noise. I'm outside. There's a car going by. Uh, let's pour some water on that. Uh, let's see what she looks like here. It's gonna be a oh yeah, look at that. That's a pretty some pretty curl going on in that in that one there. Get the sun to reflect it. You'll be able to see it. That's pretty. Sun is going down, so I ain't got much sunlight left. That's some pretty stuff. So yeah. Make some great uh, shelving boards. Somebody wants to build them a bookcase or maybe you can cut it down into trim or molding or something. There's some cool uh, cool characters going on where the knot was. Uh, I know I'm not a I'm no professional cameraman, I can guarantee you that. You're probably saying you're making me dizzy. Yeah, I'm making myself dizzy. But, all right. Well, guys, I'm going to be doing a lot more videos. Uh, this is, uh, like I say, this is a, a new channel for me. Uh, I had my other channel, uh, Robert Boyce Wood Turning. Go check that one out if you haven't. Do a lot of wood turning. Uh, but I wanted to start video on saw milling. Something I always wanted to do. Uh, of course, I got some trash over there. I still got all them logs, all them, all them wallets. Uh, I'm going to start on them next week. Should have had it done. I, I did had one that I slabbed for the for a customer, and it's done and gone. But I didn't video that one, so got those. I still got all them up on my bank. I got lots of logs, and I still got tons to get. Uh, I did get my trailer out from down in the yard, though. I got it pulled up here yesterday. But you can look at it. All the weights on the back end. Yeah, <laughs> loaded the logs, and you put the put the butt ends on the back end of the trailer. I don't know. That's okay. I didn't have to haul them for maybe half a mile, but that's all right. But we unhooked it and up she went. But yeah, we're gonna we're gonna cut them black walnuts probably next week. Uh, then I got to try to get rid of this uh, this big red oak here. That's a big one. It's I think it was twenty twenty two inches. I believe I could be wrong. It might have been twenty four. I can't remember now. But but uh, yeah, I cut me a lot of uh, uh, four by fours, two by fours. A bunch of one buys different widths because uh, this pile here and that pile right there that's all going to be my uh my shed around my sawmill i may need just a few more boards but i think i've got enough for what i want to do i ne i know i need uh about 15 more two buys two by fours but the four by fours i got plenty of i think i've got i think i've got 16 of them over there uh, and that little pile is just mostly all one by a couple slabs on top uh, there's a couple two befores uh, there on the bottom but the rest of it's all just one by you know one by whatever's from one by fives up to one by twelves and then I cut that poplar today I showed you this beautiful lumber uh, I may already have that sold to be honest with you um, maybe gone there's somebody wanting ten boards and I said I've got them so he's supposed to call me back uh, after dinner but anyway, hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, 
I'm no professional by no means. I don't claim to be. Uh, if you have any comments, uh, something I can improve on, or maybe some uh, suggestions and, you know, the way I do do milling, just please please comment. I love reading all the comments. I'm learning. Uh, I'm just watching you guys, watching all this YouTube. So uh, I enjoy reading the comments, uh, good or bad. doesn't matter to me. I'll read them. May not reply if they're bad, but hit that thumbs up, notification bell. Like I say, I'm going to cut into them walnuts uh, next week. I'll have that one, and uh, we'll uh, we'll all smell walnut together. So thank you guys for stopping by. Hit that subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one.